Thanks, everybody, for uh, being here this morning. I am uh, <clears throat> very happy to uh, announce today that uh, Terry Collins, uh, our manager, has uh, agreed to a two-year extension of his contract and will manage the Mets through uh, 2016 and 17 uh, and perhaps beyond. Um, you know, Terry did an extraordinary job this year under differing circumstances as time went on. You know, the first part of the season, um, we had high expectations. We had a high injury rate. Uh, Terry uh, kept the team together, kept it competitive, uh, kept our heads above water. Uh, later, as the, as the season wore on, we got some players back from injury. We added some players via trade, and um, he managed that group uh, with those higher expectations uh, extraordinarily well and obviously got us uh, into the World Series. Uh, we expected to have a good season. You never expect to be in the World Series. Uh, from my standpoint, it was, a, it was a successful season for us. Not as successful as it would have been had we won the World Series. But <clears throat> nonetheless, uh, I think we have as an organization a lot to be proud of with regard to this year. But the reason Terry is uh, back as manager is, is not just because of the season we had. Uh, over the previous four years, um, without the talent base, without the uh, resources that um, he ultimately had, at least for part of this season, uh, he did a, an extraordinary job as well. Um, sometimes we get frustrated that the results aren't there, but uh, results re uh, are a function, a consequence of many different things, including the talent that you have on your team. So this is uh, uh, an expression of our appreciation and our confidence in Terry going forward, uh, not just because of uh, 2015, uh, but because of the whole body of work from the time that he uh, came on board in uh, prior to the 2011 season through today. So very pleased today to announce that uh, Terry will be back as uh, our manager and uh, want to congratulate him. Thank you. Well, it, it, as I've said before, this is an honor and a privilege to, uh, to manage the New York Mets. And my thanks to the ownership group, Jeff, Fred, and Saul, to uh, give me this opportunity and certainly Sandy to, uh, you know, help me lead this thing and, and get us to where we wanted to do, uh, wanted to be, and that's in the World Series. You know, a year ago, Sandy and I sat up here and we said that it was time to win, and we meant that. And we went out with that was the only thing and the sole thing in our mind, no matter what names were on the back of uniforms, that we were going to win. Our, our fan base deserved it. Uh, it was time to, to repay their patience uh, with a winner. And Sandy fortunately helped us put, uh, put together the... Uh, the pieces we needed to get to where we wanted to get, and, and I thought we had an outstanding year. And again, I, I second the, what he said about, you know, we all want to win the World Series. We didn't, but that doesn't take away what we accomplished in the season, and that was uh, tremendous excitement in City Field and a team that we think in the future has got a, a great chance to win. So thank you so much for this opportunity, and we're going to move forward and, and uh, certainly – starting two days ago, prepare for a successful 2016 season. Terry, congratulations. Uh, Sandy, this is for you, though. When it comes to Terry Collins, and, you know, you kind of touched on it a little bit, but the results speak for themselves this year. But what was the one thing that really stood out to you, aside from the results, about his stewardship? Well, I think that, uh, and I've said this before, that, uh, Terry, I think, is appreciated by the players, uh, even by this group, as well as the fans, because of his authenticity. Uh, Terry tries to be as honest as he can be without throwing people under the bus. And uh, his ability to communicate and maintain the level of uh, commitment in the clubhouse, uh, regardless of circumstance, I think has always been a, a tremendous strength on his part. And. Uh, you know, leadership is difficult to define. Uh, it's difficult to teach. Uh, but I think Terry, with his experience, uh, his past Major League experience, his 
uh, experience as a minor league uh, coach and uh, player development head and so forth, um, has learned a great deal about that and uh, I think has been, uh, you know, sort of the cornerstone of his success. And that is uh, being able to tell the players uh, like it is um, without uh, jeopardizing or criticizing them directly in public. And that's a hard line uh, to walk. But uh, he's been very successful at it. And I think that uh, that's what the players appreciate. And I think, as I said, uh, to a large extent, the fans appreciate um, his honesty as well.